Good afternoon, I'm Adam Clements. And I'm Kyle Inskeep. There could be hope for thousands of Hamilton County families struggling to pay their rent. Yeah, the three and a half million dollars in federal money that was set aside to help went pretty fast. Local 12's Alexa Helwig is live now at the UC Medical Center to show us how more money could be on the way. And she gives us a county COVID-19 update. Good afternoon, Alexa. Good afternoon, Adam and Kyle. Well, the the, the county today had a press briefing and the county health commissioner says that uh, the trend of the number of COVID-19 cases in the county is on the decline. So today they're reporting in total more than 8,000 confirmed cases and 233 deaths. But that's not all they talked about. Take a listen to how struggling families and small businesses could soon see more help. Hamilton County was awarded $142 million from the Federal CARES Act back in April. It's to help respond to the COVID-19 pandemic. Just last week, $3.5 million of it was put towards a program to help people pay their rent. On the first day, a couple thousand people applied. 2,000 is a very large number. We were hoping to address maybe 1,200 or so families so that uh, demand is great. We suspect that most of them do qualify for the dollars. Commissioner Denise Driehaus says the demand is so high, the county is now working to put more money toward the program. We need to rearrange some of the funding through the CARES Act to address what we know is one of the greatest needs in our community. And as the pandemic continues to keep people out of work, Driehaus says the commission will take up legislation to add another $3.5 million for struggling families. So it'll bring the total to $7 million. The county also budgeted $7.5 million from the Federal CARES Act to help small businesses. Remember, we did one round of this. Um, it was fairly constricted. Uh, those that qualified uh, couldn't have gotten any federal money. They had to be of a, a certain size. Uh, so we had uh, some parameters around that. The county helped 200 small businesses. 50% were minority owned and the other 50 was women owned. Commissioner Driehaus says there's another round coming. So what we're going to do is tweak the program, expand the group that is eligible for these dollars and do another round. So obviously some very positive news coming out of today's press conference. Commissioner Driehaus also mentioned that the county will be making a major announcement tomorrow regarding regarding COVID-19 testing in the future. We're live outside of UC Medical Center, Alexa Helwig, Local 12 News. All right, Alexa, thank you for that. The interim county health commissioner says the majority of people in Hamilton County are wearing masks. Greg Kesterman says.